What's up comic book readers? Welcome to Too Many Comics. I'm your host Eric and today we are taking a look at a title now published at Fantagraphics. Mort Cinder by artist Alberto Breccia and writer Hector Hermann Esterheld. For the first time officially translated in English and presented in a single book, Mort Cinder is an episodic comic divided into nine short stories. Each of them being a take on its own genre, like suspense, horror, and even science fiction. Through these, the reader follows the journey through time and space of the titular character Mort Cinder. A man who rises from the grave each time he is killed, and his sidekick Ezra Winston, an antiquarian who has devoted his life to his shop retracing the life of objects from the past. Most of these stories are articulated through the perception of Ezra as Mort Cinder reminisces his past lives. From the construction of the Babel Tower, the African slave trade, to the First World War, Esterheld explores mankind's undersides with a great sensitivity. Where this book really shines though is in the harmony between the narrative and the artwork. Breccia was a master of the chiaroscuro technique, which uses the contrast between light and dark to portray the action. Playing with themes like past and present, and life and death, the medium allows darkness to complement the white both morally and artistically. With a very balanced touch of abstract, the art achieves to tell you what the script doesn't. It's also worth noting that with every episode being its own genre, Breccia uses small changes in his style, making them feel distinct and original. As always, if this video has given you a taste to look forward into this story, I highly encourage you to go to your local comic book store and dig down into Mort Cinder. This is it for this video, and until next time, keep on reading!